Russia could test the waters with NATO countries next if the West fails to react strongly enough to an invasion from Vladimir Putin of Ukraine, a foreign policy expert has warned. War fears have skyrocketed with Russia massing tens of thousands of troops near its border with Ukraine. Moscow is locking horns with NATO, demanding wide-ranging guarantees from the West including a pledge its neighbor never be allowed to join the defense alliance. Russia has denied it has any plans to attack its neighbor as Western powers threaten Mr. Putin's country with crippling economic sanctions if an invasion does take place. Both the US and Britain have started sending more arms to Ukraine, with thousands of troops from both countries understood to be on standby. But some leading NATO members, particularly Germany, have come under attack for not following other Western countries in sending Kiev lethal weapons to defend itself against a possible attack. Niall Gardiner, a foreign policy analyst and former aide to Margaret Thatcher, warned the West making concessions to Russia over Ukraine will prove to be very dangerous. He also warned if the West fails to flex its muscles here, President Putin could turn his attention to NATO countries. Mr. Gardiner told Express.co.uk, if Russia gets away with invading and occupying large parts of the Ukraine, in addition to Crimea, they could set their sights next on the Baltic states. It is very dangerous for the West to make any concessions over Ukraine. If the West does nothing here, Putin could test the waters with NATO countries next. The foreign policy expert also launched a furious attack against both Germany and France, accusing both of not doing enough to stand up to Russia or defend NATO territory. Halting the Nord Stream 2 pipeline into Europe remains a key sanction the West could hit Russia with, but that could trigger a gas supply crisis that has sent energy prices throughout the continent soaring. Germany is supplying just 5,000 military helmets to Ukraine to help defend against a possible Russian attack, an offer Kiev Mayor Vitaly Klitschko called a joke that left him speechless. Earlier this week, German Chancellor Olaf Scholz defended his country's record on supporting Ukraine.